Hello everybody, what is up? It is Big Cheese back here again with another episode of Adventures of Shoe and Friends. And if any of you didn't watch my vlog, I actually said at the very end of it that I was thinking about changing the name to The Chronicles of Nenia. Because, <laughs> get the pun, because The Chronicles of Narnia and it's kind of a fantasy world with weird creatures and people and things and... Yeah, that's... It's punny. <laughs> but, I don't want to steal from one of my friends, but... No. What's up, everybody? Uh, last episode, we had our first boss battle of the game, and... No, that's not what these giant craters are about. And what these giant craters are about... Well, we'll learn that later on in the episode, but right now I'm just kicking some rocks, trying to find some stuff. But, in the meantime, when... Since the last episode, I did a little grinding up. Um, as you can see, everybody's level 8 now, and everybody's classes are at level 10. So, I'm going to change Shoe's Shadow back now down to the Generalist class, so that I can choose his skills and everything. Because as you can see, I can equip one special accessory. We don't have any of those yet, but we will be able to pick them up very soon. I'm going to change Klooks to Generalist then once she gets to 15 or whenever Shu gets to level 5 in Generalist. And then whenever I get Jiro to level 20 or Kluke gets to Generalist level 5, will I change Jiro? So, because I kind of want to keep it I'm pretty even, but I also want to have a bunch of these spaces so that I can do a bunch of stuff. And I also picked up another item that I, there was a chest. See, Shu's got a special slot now, but he also has a copper bracelet now, which boosts his attack 20, which is a lot better comparatively to his past attack, which was 34. Now it's 44. And he's even stronger than the others now. But let's check out this chest here. What's inside this chest? And copper earring. All right. Um, let's open up the menu and see what that has to has in store for us. I think the magical defense. Okay, it boosts magic defense by 35. Wow. Okay. Um. Yeah, so that will boost Jiro up to 46. Wow. I think we're gonna do it. Yeah, we're gonna do it. All right. Um, but yeah. Um, let's just kick this rock here and thorn grass, nothing big. And let's see what's in this tree, tree trunk. 10 gold, nothing big. Um, all right, let's see what's over here, though. It looks long and barren. Ooh, it's a loading screen. Okay. Um, but yeah. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna try to keep the intros kind of short now, because I know these episodes go on pretty long, but here we are in the Eastern Lot Wilderness now. As you can see, we're in the Overworld now, the major Overworld, and we can save at any time now. So, that's pretty cool, but let's go take on, um, I don't know, let's try to search around for another enemy right now, maybe, I don't know, um, alright, ooh, what's this? Ooh, it's a scavenger wolf ghost, let's get into a double battle with this thing, with a green grunt, but I hope we fight the scavenger wolf, yeah, we fight him first, alright, um, these things, normally they flee from you, except when you have stink on you, then you, they will attack you, but they, they are actually pretty powerful. Um, I forget. I don't think they're weak to any normal thing. So let's just go for a flare sword, I guess, and see what it has to do. And boom. Oh, wow. They go, yeah, they go down real easy. And hit rate, uh, I would have preferred vitality, but either way, um, let's go for just a regular attack on you, just because we can. And, hmm, let's go for a water. Oh, wow. Clean slate there. All right. That's awesome. Water. Water. Would you like some water? And looked like the one guy took more damage than the other, but okay. Uh, wow, really? You suck. Ooh, right. I gotta knock those things out of the, their hands. That is not good. And let's just attack this little dude here. And is it gonna kill? It's not gonna kill both, but it'll kill that one. What? 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 You stink. Uh, let's knock that weapon out of your hand. You're probably gonna die anyways. But either way, 57, yeah. Dead like a donay. 
All right, and rank up. All right, nice. Um, we don't get anything from rank number two, though, unfortunately. And another scavenger wolf ghost. And we got a back attack, too. <laughs> I just did a tiger, tiger woods air thing. I don't even know what I'm talking about. And okay, that did some damage. Let's just attack this little buddy here. Dead and dead. There we go. We all good. Now we got to see the scavenger wolf ghost. I'm not gonna fight too many more, and yeah, rank up every single turn, basically. And there's a chest over here. Let's see what's inside it. And Vitality Elixir, what is that? That sounds interesting. Let's go down and see what it might, it's not in healing? Really? That's interesting. Okay, well, let's go out. Um, Vitality Elixir. Ooh, we also have Kelalon Powder, which turns the target into a Kelalon, which we'll find out what Kelalons are. I'm never going to use this, but it's interesting. Um, and the Vitality Elixir restores HP over time during battle. Ooh, that is actually pretty good. Okay. And hello, Green Grunt. I don't want to fight you. Bye-bye. Yeah, as you can tell, you can easily avoid things, and whoa, what is this? What is it? <gasps> whoa. So this must be what drilled all those holes. Maybe yeah, it must this, be. Just like the land shark. Maybe he's You're probably not far village. off. Let's take a look inside. If I'm right, we might be able to use our magic to work this thing. Then we'll be able to drive it back home. That would be awesome. Yeah. Good plan, Jiro. Join. And I'm going to turn this down because we... But I don't think... Um, yeah, let's do it. Climb the ladder. I was going to say maybe we should... Maybe we're gonna go do something else and just explore around the lot wilderness, but no, we'll do that another time. <gasps> Whoa! It's moving! What's going on? Uh-oh. What's that? The drill, it's spinning! And it's drilling into the ground again! What's going on? This is, whoa, awesome. Join. All right, here is a new, sp well, we've seen these type of chests in the Flying Fortress before, so yeah, it's definitely one of Nene's mechanisms. Ooh, here we go, our first EXP boost right here. All right, we can actually give EXP m through special like things like this, and we can give it to our characters. We're going to give it to Kluke since she usually levels up last. So we're going to do that. And let's just run around. <gasps> what are you? Rawr! Whoa. You don't attack. Number number 18. Welcome, honored customer. These are our items. These are the items our masters used. They should have the same effects on you. I believe you will like them. They are available for purchase. What are you looking for? Items? Accessories? Spells? Um, let's check out spells right now. And let's sell some stuff first. Um, hmm. Heals about 100 HP. We never use the garlic just because it adds stink. Antidote, yes. Um, paralyzed, dizzy, um... Inflicts a small amount of damage on a row. Yeah, get rid And the Kelalon Powder. Vitality Elixir, we might want to keep. I don't think I'll ever use it, but... Stone Bracelet, get rid of. Stone Earring, get rid of. And that's really it. Alright. 460 gold, not bad. Now, let's buy some more. Okay, Cure Poison, finally. That was actually when I was training. I got poisoned all the time. It was annoying. And, alright, uh, 
Let's cancel that. Your business is appreciated. Would you like to shop some more? Yeah, why not? Let's check out the accessories because now we can buy copper stuff. Okay. Awesome. And let's just boost everything on shoe. And Jiro already has a copper earring on. And bling, bling, bling. We got some bling on our peeps. Peeps and peoples. And wow, that's, ugh, that's expensive, but worth it, worth it, worth it. All right, and yeah, we can't sell anything. Your business is appreciated. Would you like to shop some more? No, I never buy items. So let's put on some accessories then. All right, copper ring, stone ring, copper necklace. There we go, and we can't buy, we never buy specialty items. And copper ear necklace and copper, 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 and copper. There we go. And now let's sell all these stone stuff because stones, stones outdated now. So it doesn't matter. And blah, 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 stone bracelet, two of them, three of these, three of these, two of these. And there we go, 505 gold. I kind of would have preferred something more, but... Oh, no, 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 cancel, there we go. And let's open up this chest then. Phoenix Talon, alright, that's pretty cool. And here's another guy, hello. Do you want to learn a combat technique the masters taught me? The charge meter displays an orange bar called the sweet spot. If you stop charging right when the meter reaches the sweet spot, your MP consumption and the time until your next move will be reduced. Healing via electrowave hypnosis costs 18 gold. Buy it? Yeah, so this thing is basically sleeping, which will heal you, obviously. As in every... RPG healing sleeping will heal you healing has been completed. Please come again. All right, but yeah That thing it said before I basically already told you that but let's save here um, 13 minutes in um, Let's keep going. This is a short. This is a short little spot right here, and it's locked Ooh. So we got to go through here then Go to floor 2A? Yeah, why not? Let's go to floor 2A. And I have to go to the bathroom. Um, that might be bad eventually. And I'm hungry, and it's 1.30 at night. I probably shouldn't eat this late, but I'm not going to be able to fall asleep if I don't. That's going to stink, but let's see what these gauges do. You examine the five gauges. An indicator needle is moving. Base. Ooh, here's an- Oh, I forgot to mention that in the last episode, that we passed a green one of those, which, it's basically a blue one, just we have to have a different device to activate it. Um, yeah, basically that's it. Um, we still don't even know what that stuff is, and really? Okay, whatever, I don't- I'm not complaining, but here's another chest. This place actually is full of chests. And it's basically a giant treasure trove in this place because there's not that many enemies and there's a lot of treasure. So definitely worth it. Definitely worth it. Um, let's just go over heels. And what's this? Another gauge thing. Never. Oh, what is this thing? Let's hide from it because it's, what is it? Maybe, maybe it's nice like the old ones. Hello, sir. Detective. Whoa! No, it's not. No, it's not. No, it's not. Hello. Let's attack. It's called a medic main maintenance, sir. Basically, these little things will show up, and it will do that. It will basically make these things tough to kill. It's a medic. Medics are annoying in general. Always. Medics are always annoying. We all know this, but let's attack this. Um, 51 damage, and it still doesn't die. Really, that is annoying. But, yeah, there, one of them died then. But let's do a wind against it, since one of them is waterproof now. Um, yeah, look, three damage, no, nothing. All right, wind, yeah, it takes them all out. It, they go down pretty easy, actually. Most machines will, and... Really? She didn't get a rank up from that? that uh, that's unfortunate. Ooh, what's up here? What is... 
up here. Who are you? Don't mess with Morrow. Who's Morrow? Morrow? That's not Nene's voice. Yeah, and Nene never called himself Morrow. And it's huh. not the voice of the light spheres either. <gasps> what is it? Oh, another Mecha Robo! Oh no! It's no! If that robot is here, maybe the voice we heard is a comrade of Nene's. Yeah, that's right. This is good. Then maybe the voice can tell us how we can find Nene. The voice. Get yeah. Him. Get him! Who is this Moro character? And why is he not wanting us to do stuff? I don't know. I don't even know. Wow, yeah, he missed. Let's do a mowdown on these. Wow! Um, that was easy. I feel like I should have a staples button right now. <laughs> Were those robots always that weak? No, we've gotten strong. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Well, we can ask whoever that voice is to tell us about Nene. Alright. Um, let's go down here then. It won't open. I do hear somebody inside. Maybe it is locked from somewhere else. It is, so we gotta go... Sh I'm gonna find it somewhere. So let's go find where we have. Oh, here's another medic maintenance, sir. What are you doing, medic maintenance, sir? Yeah, I'm really hungry. After I'm done recording this, I'm gonna get something to eat. I don't know what though. <laughs> and you have to waterproof something, don't you? Uh, but let's attack you just because we can. And no downs. You gotta kill off one of them at least. Uh, and then we can wind it up, up, up. All right, there we go. And we got in before the medic maintenance, sir, at least. And we're gonna take them all out then, because it's wind. And oh wow, we didn't kill the medic maintenance, sir. Okay. Movement maintenance. Yeah, basically he just heals himself. No big deal. And let's just attack him one more time. And ooh, I think that was the first time we saw the dragon's wings like go out like that. That that's pretty cool. I've seen it before, but I I <laughs> it is pretty cool. You examine the switch. This elevator goes to floor two B. Would do you want to go to floor two B? Yes. Let's go to floor two B then. And yeah. Ooh. I don't even want to move. I gotta go to the bathroom that bad. Oi. Um, 19 minutes, not bad. I think we can finish up with this little thing here. And here's another medic maintenance. Rar. Whoa, cutscene. Treasure, my treasure. You want to steal my treasure? You must stay away from my treasure. What? It is crazy! It is crazy! Roar! It's a crazy illegal modification. So yeah, basically this is a boss fight. It's not that hard of a boss fight, actually. It's actually a really easy boss fight. Knockback. Yeah. This 30 oh. Alright. You you are dying. You are dying right now. Um <laughs> I don't like you now. I officially do not like you. Um, let's go for a water sword so that we can cool him down at first. I probably should have... 25. Yeah. Water caused a short and burn. Body is overheated. And... Spin dried back to normal. Yeah. He... We just keep doing that. He'll never... He'll never be able to do damage to us again if we keep doing that. Okay, we're just gonna get in before Shu, and let's go for a water then. And are we in before Shu? Yeah, we are, darn. I wanted to be in after Shu, but no big deal. And water? Jeez. Water caused a short, and now... We're going to Flare Sword you, because Flare Sword does a lot of damage. Boom, baby. 23, wow. Body is overheated. But he is spin-drying himself to nothingness. Maintenance, what? Oh, why you gotta be like that? Insufficient spare parts. Maintenance, not... <laughs> yeah, this... This whole battle, I don't under- I never understand a lot of these battles, but let's go for a flare, I guess, and get in before him. So... So that he has to do his own attack thing to... 
I don't know. 89, okay. Body is overheated. Maintenance cooling. Um, maybe we should try and... Maybe we should try this. Because he seems weaker to water. Yeah, 25. Uh, I don't know. Spin drive back. He ran away? What? Oh, this is the final part. Okay. Yeah, this is the final part. Um, no, it's not. Darn. I thought that was the final part where he actually called in his comrades. Comrade! Yes, because we are Roshin, and he has comrades. And caused the short, and one more. Let's go for... Maybe I have to do wind against him or something. I don't know. But usually I just beat down on him. And one more attack. Yeah, he's down for the count now. There we go. I never understand that fight, really, but it took three minutes. Wow. I might actually just super speed it. Oh, we got accessory plus one for for realsies now. Take that! You beat me. I apologize for interfering. Here, take my treasure to make up for it. And what's... Warp key times 23. Yes. We put these... Well, he'll explain it. What is this? My apologies. My deepest apologies. Let me explain about this treasure. Warping. To activate a warp device, use one of your warp keys. You can warp to any of the active warp devices. After your, forced war After your first warp key is used, the warp option is available in the main menu. If you select the warp option, all of the locations you can warp to are displayed. To warp to a selected de location, press the OK button. There are times when a magical magnetic field prevents you from warping. That is all I have to explain. Oh, and by the way, I also unlocked the door to the cockpit. The cockpit door has been unlocked. Please forgive me. I'm so, so sorry. This is the warp device. Insert warp key to activate it. Yeah, so that's basically warping and everything. We won't be using it that often, and this... We actually saw this thing in the Shreep Tribe camp, if you remember, and I was like, Whoa, what is that? It is a warp device. So, we already have an activated warp device somewhere in the world. And let's check what... A ruby, okay, that'll sell pretty well. And metals, okay. Still don't know what metals are, huh? Well, we will find out... Pretty soon, I'm thinking. Maybe a couple more episodes from now. Um... I told you about the man Toripo. Toripo, Toripo. Yeah, Toripo is going to be the one that will want the medals. We want all the medals that we can get. And why did I click on that? Um, because they give us hearts, which allow us to unlock to unlock more of our skill level ups. But anyways, let's let's get done with this place and see what this mysterious voice is. And I am sorry, I am hiccuping like a boss. I don't know how hiccuping can be like a boss, but... <gasps> Shh. <gasps> Bad outfit. You're of the Devi tribe, right? What's so bad about that? Don't you dare mess with Moro! Who's driving this thing? And whoa, he has a shadow? Don't lump him in. What? What's going on? Why is it a saber-toothed tiger? And why are we now in a spaceship? Okay. Um, basically, we just got to beat down on him. Um, let's not even attack with magic. Because all we have to do is beat down on him over and over again. I'm not even going to use magic. Because you can't really lose this fight. And... Yeah, as you can tell, there's a counter-attack. Um, but why does he have a shadow? What's going on? Yeah, there's a counter. 
And boom. 15. Counter. Yeah. Um. Yeah. See? You too? You too? Where? Where are we? What is going on? <gasps> We're going into the earth. <gasps> what is that? A giant tower? We're defying gravity. Ah! What the? Get him! He's getting away! We should stop him. He's our link to Nene, but I don't think he's our enemy. What makes you say that? Remember, he said not to lump them together. He knows about Nene, but hates him too. Hmm. <sighs> okay, that's enough talking. Let's go! Why is Kluk always the one that makes the most sense? Oh, right, she's a woman. <laughs> I'm sorry, that was, that was very mean. Actually, well, that's mean against men, and I'm a man, so, um, but, yeah, um, 28 minutes, hopefully we can, actually, yeah, we can save right here, um, and there's a bunch of chests here, too, no ghost device, um, once I open all these chests, I'll show you what that is, light crystal, we know what that is, sapphire, basically does water damage but let's check out the no ghost device um you don't get much use out of it i gotta admit that you do not get much use out of it and it's in healing so let's go down no ghost device cures the zombie and ghost status ailments that does not happen often um you actually don't get to use it that often but let's save again and save your progress yes um, drill machine, one floor, all right, and that's really all we're gonna do today, let's just heal one more time, because we got the money for it, and yeah, I'm just gonna save again, because I should have healed before I saved, but oh well, and drill machine, there we go, and saved content. All right, everybody, um, that's really it for today. Um, tomorrow we're going to, f or ugh, next episode, not tomorrow, probably tomorrow, but yeah. Um, next episode, we're going to go into the ancient, well, the ancient whatever this is, underground thing. So, all right, everybody, next episode then. See y'all later. Goodbye.